Hey, what's up guys? Okay, so we're meeting the Blab guys out to start filming the show. So we're heading out to Bayou Chico. Gotta meet Brant down at the boat ramp. And we're gonna meet the new film crew. So let's go. All right guys, day one of shooting for the TV show. We got the camera guys. We're headed out on the boat. Me and Brand are getting mic'd up. It pays to have no hair on your chest. That's what I'm learning. It's gonna get taped on. Think about being mic'd up. You know, I don't really have any thoughts at the moment. You're not semi-pro anymore. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll just, we'll, we'll see. <laughs> Brant was casting. They got hung up. He had to go all the way around to get it. <laughs> all the way around. So funny story about today, we were shooting the intro to the show and a bird out of nowhere put droppings right on my hat. Check this out. See that? Oh man. I had to wash that out in the middle of the segment. It's the craziest thing I've ever seen. On to the beach. Sure, what they're doing here. I don't know what, the, what they're doing. Straight up power wash on the beach. That's pretty cool. Wow. Look at that water. Any fish? Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah, pretty cool. How y'all doing? February water, still a tad cold. I was out there for like an hour. Body's fine, feet are freezing. Look how beautiful the water is. It's like floating on a cloud out there, totally worth it. And if you want to... So what happens next? What happens next, so you will not Guess what I did next. I had set the GoPro on the bumper of the truck to get the footage of this van because it was epic. It was like a legitimate surfer vehicle. Only like 1,500 of these bad boys made. I met these awesome two guys on the beach. They've been surfing this break for like 40 years. They were in their 60s and they were just shredded up. So I had to get his van. But I forgot the GoPro. Just wait and see what happens. got on the three mile bridge and realized I left my GoPro on the back of my truck. All right, hope it's still back there. Only choice I got is when I get off the bridge, I gotta turn around and go all the way back to the beach and hopefully it's somewhere in the middle of the road. Dude, I lost my GoPro and I, I was driving back all the way to the beach and I saw it in the middle of the road and I, th I think I found it, I gotta go get it. There it is, right there. Cannot believe I put it on the back of the truck and drove off and forgot about it. And I can't believe it's sitting there. I hope a car don't run over it by the time I get there. There it is. Any other time of the year and that thing would have been crushed. Got sand spurs in my feet and everything. If y'all don't know about sand spurs, they're in the sand here. It looks like it's soft, but they get in your feet and they're sharp. 
and there's spurs. All right, I cannot believe I, I got the GoPro back. That is wild. I never thought that I would see that thing again. And it was left on. I wonder what the footage on here is going to say. That thing's been in the middle of the highway this entire time, and it's been on. This is going to be nuts. I think the people that were saw me out there trying to get this thing thought I was nuts, too. It's right in front of the turn lane at Margaritaville. If that gate would have been open, this thing would have died. It was right there. It's a shame still waters run